What is this? Oh, sack puppets. Sack puppets. You're making sack puppets. Oh wow, look at this. I'm Britta. I, I've and got I just want to tell you, home. I look very, very cute. <laughs> what are you girls doing? Uh, just like here, here Zoe. Like, oh, boy. Are you reading or what? Uh, that just. What are you doing? Playing Johnny's mask page. Is that a word game? Or no. Mask you have to use the arrows to like move this, but if you yeah, don't, if you go out there or fall through these holes. I think it's neat. It actually makes them use their head. Yeah, it looks like a lot of fun. Too. Yeah. Ellen. Hey. Who is it? Ellen. Speed tag. Speed tag. Sports bingo, all put together. It's made. Which one's Whoa, sports bingo? Whoa, that sounds really exciting. Can I play? This word. Let's see. Who would like to read that? Gloria. Net. Net. All right. Oh, do you have a net on there? Okay. You're reading in the dark? Why? I have a flashlight. Oh. What are you reading? Um, Jack Rabbit Goalie. Is that a good book? Yeah. You know, we, we've been putting together this for our community, and we, we serve a little bit of a meal for them. Not, nothing fancy, uh, don't get me wrong, but it's, uh, we serve a meal. We have kids moving around and families moving around the building and different reading activities. For instance, uh, they might make a sock puppet, and then they would take that sock puppet, and they would maybe, maybe make a play out of it so that they're reading plays and, and performing with their sock puppet or... Uh, I know Mr. Kern has second grade. They're singing songs, so they're reading music. Um, they're just way, just a lot of different activities going on using reading, and it's mm -hmm. just a great night to see all these people. It's my fifth year being principal at uh, Spooner Elementary School, and every time we have a family function, uh, the turnout has always been incredible. Whether it be a uh, Christmas concert, whether it be a f uh, reading math day. Or I'm sorry, a family math day, or this reading thing. We always get people here for anything that happens. So we get great support from our community. I'm Amy Young. I'm an AmeriCorps Farm School member for Spooner. I've been here for four years. And I'm Robin Heyer. I'm uh, AmeriCorps Farm to School. And My name is Jessica Spooner. I'm uh, AmeriCorps Service for Learning in Life. The point is to bring families into the school and show them what we have going on and to encourage families to read together and play together and be active together. So, Johnson? Sharon Johnson. I'm an AmeriCorps member here. Yeah. Um, I was just asking, how do they get all these parents here tonight? This is incredible. Um, well, this is actually a combined event, and it was our idea this year to combine Family Reading Night with the Fall Festival Open House. Oh, okay. So the Open House typically gets people here anyway, and it's the goal of our principal here at the elementary school to have a number of community events throughout the year. So right. we have lots going on, and in the fall, this is the big one. Parents, basically, that are involved in a student's academic life, coming to the school, being involved in the school, the students do much better because they see the emphasis that the parent puts on their education, and it really helps them strive. Plus, just getting the, the student here, too, at night really gets them more comfortable with the school setting besides just being here during the school day. Anything in particular, you, you the, this year is a little bit different from last year? This year is a little different because we did combine it with the open house. So we are combining two events and in the hopes that it will bring the staff and the parents and the teachers um, mm -hmm. all together. And that just strengthens the whole process. Yeah. Our first song we're going to sing is a very important song called our national anthem. Say can you sing by the dawn? So we are learning the Spanish names of sports and music and baseball. And then it's a really good idea to staple it at least 
halfway. Hi, I'm Mrs. Weamery, Stacy Weamery. I'm the school nurse for um, Spooner. And, and what do you have a plate here? So. We have a plate. Team Wellness bought a um, hundred of these plates to use at the elementary school okay. to show kids a great visual on what you should be eating. During the day, half your plate should be fruits and vegetables, and a quarter should be protein and grains. And our reading component for reading night was how to read a nutrition label. So I always That's tell my kids it's not a... <laughs> when you so parents brought, or took these home tonight with their kids, and they're going to go through nutrition labels and oh, break really? it down. Good.